what is going on everybody welcome to into my gt entertainment and of course i am joel nice to see you here on this kind of cloudy day and uh we are again in a different location um you'll be able to see where we are here in a minute but derek is graciously allowing us to use his garage and his lift to do some upgrades on minion we're going to go ahead and change out some headlights redo the tail lights and the deck lid and whatever else decides to pop in along the way so come join us for this little uh revamp revamp of minion 5o and uh we'll see you in a bit Santa Claus has brought his gifts for Brandon. So uh, this is the monotony of today that he's gonna be doing. I'll let him explain probably most of it, but uh, just here to lend a hand. Well, while they're trying to figure life out, let me give you the little tour of uh, what Derek's got going on here. Minus one vehicle, because y'all don't get to see that quite yet. But uh, let me show you what is going on here. Let me flip this around real quick. You got Karma. You have Maverick. You have Mr. Two Valve. And you have Apex. Now there is something else over here, but I'm not going to get into that right now. And then Lucifer, of course, in the home where it needs to be. And of course, one of the fastest cars here. Yeah, just joking, guys. Uh, got an old Nightwing. So right now, Brandon's getting the car on the lift. So we can go ahead and do what we need to do with this. Um, he's got the new headlights, which I can kind of show you while they're trying to figure out life right now. Um, he's putting the S650 lights on there. So... Now double check your lined up. Before you take the, jack out. the reasoning for that is because his other ones are kind of fogged up a little bit and kind of wear and tear. So I don't know if the camera picks it up real good. Yeah, it does. So as you can see, it's all hazy. And, you know, he's cleaned them before. But, hey, you know, if you can go ahead and change them up when you can, I suppose you can. And he's actually working. Which is, the, this is what I should make a video of, just him doing stuff. Because that usually don't happen. But anyway, once we start getting into the install, I'll let y'all see what's going on. I'll probably be doing a lot more over here, and then he is also changing out his tail lights because they have yellowed, and his deck lid because Brandon. Yeah, they've gotten just kind of bad. So that's what the project of today is. So we will hit that as we go. Brandon is getting a crash course on how to wire up a lift real quick so and of course that's the site we always see but uh <laughs> so, but um yeah he's getting this squared away now hey when he hits up on that yeah. lift he yeah. was in charge of putting on right. the pinch weld so if yeah. his car snaps in half that's on him well you know you want to make sure they're not pink so unroll it unravel it fully he'd be learning today Yeah. I didn't do shit. Yeah, that's how I feel. I was like, why do I gotta go? I watch you work. I, I, my job's done. I gave him lights and a lift. Yep. <laughs> my job and a fan. And he has, he has some air now. How confident are you? Uh, this is the one I buried the lift in my life. Car stabs in half. Fucking pocket panels fall off. Mm -hmm. Check them Brembo's out, though. Brembo's a little clean. We'll check those out as soon as they're in the air. But let her wait. All right. Uh, this one, right? Oh, well, she's lifting. All right, so now I'll stop. Make sure you're all on the pinch wells nice and even. The car's gonna do a damn wheelie and fly off of that. <laughs> it's gonna be like a dream. Doing good. <laughs> Geeking it out. 
Ready or not, here we go. <laughs> the yellow looks really good in here. I know this isn't so exciting, but you never know what's going to happen, so I have to fill it. Okay, it hit the locks now. No, it's locked. No, I think that's locked now. I think so. Oh, yeah, it hit both, did it? Is it all the way released? Yeah. Alright, now unplug it. There we go. At least it didn't fall off. I was just waiting for that to happen. And just for reference, just wanted y'all to see the new calipers with the wheels on it. Looks pretty fire. Does good with the paint. But yeah, we're gonna to get to the other parts of this car now. If y'all remember earlier, I don't know if I ever made a video, but he did get the calipers painted yellow. So they do look pretty good. Still trying to feel out the back. I don't know. I mean they look fine. It's just I don't know. They're just I don't they seem I don't know. I don't have an answer for you. I just, I don't know if I like it or don't. Here's a better look at the uh, Brimboats he got painted. I think they look pretty close to what the car is. But you could tell he's been hot spotting these rotors, haven't you? They're brand new rotors. Yeah. It's the pads. I don't know. They're, these rotors are hot spotted like crazy. But you could tell what he was doing when he did it. So, you know, it's, it wasn't just normal driving. All right, the first thing that he's doing is taking out the tray at the top, and then he's going to tackle these headlights. I'm here for moral support, um, just in case he gets hung up on something that needs some wiring issues or yay, yada, yada, yada. Brandon is going to be doing most of the work on everything today. So this might be a three-day video, but we'll figure it out. This is how you learn, right guys? This is how you learn. People in the comments too, tell him to get rid of his uh, Amish mustache. Shut up. Beard thing going on. <laughs> you should go beard this one time. Yes, that is Brandon actually under the vehicle sliding his roly-poly butt everywhere he goes. At least Derek got a clean spot on the floor now. But, oh, uh, yeah. It's <laughs> But he's got it because his car is put together with bubble gum and zip ties. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we have to kind of, you know, put everything together. So a lot of the places that used to have bolts and whatever don't now because the lip is different and, you know, yada, yada, yada. So, of course, I went back and zip tied everything to make sure nothing flew off. As you can see, he's got big mice in his car, too. Done ate a hole in his fender liner. Um, that was from his track day, and tire was rubbing on it because the wind was pushing it back. So that's where the zip ties come in. So, um, yeah, he's getting around to getting his bumper off. We're trying to figure out a, a way to keep his bumper in one piece because I don't know why the fitment of this thing is so bad. But over well, we'll here... We'll find out once the bumper comes off. Yeah, right there, it's just awful. And that's not even the worst it's looked, I don't think. But, um, yeah, we got to figure that part out, too. I almost bought a new bumper bracket. And now they got the bumper off. And the reason why you always see Brandon kicking his car on this side and that bad part, it actually, the clip on the bumper itself broke. So there's nothing there to attach it to the car itself. So I don't know exactly how that's going to be fixed or corrected. But the only way is quick release pins. Yeah. And quick release pins possibly or we'll just start jamming screws into it and you know it's all good we'll, I, um, I we'll put some band-aid 
So the last clip he has, I actually pushed it up. So maybe so it'll when get we in better. Snap this one in, hopefully it will get tighter. Same with this one. All right. And then Brandon's taking off the headlights now, but let me come over there and pick it up before he drops it on the ground. I say we, we gotta. So yeah. Yeah, Brandon, don't punch this in this. Right now they are figuring out the wiring of what's the best part. As you can see, I'll show you on this one while they work. They have these colored caps. Now these caps identify of what the DRLs are going to do. So the blue ones do what? Its gender. Hey, yeah. that's how the world is today. So what does the blue one do, Brandon? Uh, I don't remember off the top of my head. I have to look. I, have I to thought look. you were a geek at this. Show. Yeah. Get with it. I, I'm sorry, people. I, I overthought this and I thought he would have an answer oh, for no, me. No, no, no. But it's all good. We'll figure it out. I'm just fitting in here real quick just to show you that they got the first one on. It does work pretty good um, the way that Brandon has it all set up. I don't know if Derek wants to reach in there and just turn on the lights real quick for me. I have them off. You should just be able to spin the knob. Yep. Yeah, that's the parking light. And then uh, go one more. There you go. And that's the sequence that it turns on. So they kind of look familiar eerily to say. But I know. Look at that. <laughs> yeah. We are renaming Minion to Identity Crisis. But yeah, I think it's going to look really good if everything fits together like it's supposed to. All right, so this is what it looks like now. We still got to close the hood to make sure everything lines up correctly, but for the most part, we think it's going to be good. Brandon is putting the wheels back on now, and that'll finish this front project. Doesn't look half bad. Again, it has an identity crisis, you know, because it's got all sorts of years going on in this car right now. And um, hey, makes him a little different. He is a little special. Look at him. <laughs> See, told you. And then this is the black key, which is amber DRL, which looks kind of hard. The amber kind of goes crazy. Uh, that's what I'll be riding around in. Although, and actually, you won't even have to black that out if you have that. It looks kind of good. Well, there is the headlights. Everything is tied up and snug down. Still has a problem over here in this corner, but we kind of worked on it a little bit to see if we can make it a little better. The clip actually on the bumper broke, so it won't stay in. Um, unfortunately, kind of happens with the aftermarket, and he did have an accident. So, you know, when um, that got all repaired, I guess that might have been broken out too. But, nonetheless, the lighting in here really makes the car pop. Uh, we are going to venture in now to replace this deck lid and change out those yellow euros and putting in some brand new clear ones. Let's keep it going.